Hey everyone, Ramdi here, and I have some unfortunate news. See, there's an epidemic spreading throughout the creator sphere, and it's known as Obscurivox Syndrome. Imagine this, you have the best podcast or video channel in the world, but if you don't promote it, no one's gonna know it exists. So naturally, you'd think that the cure for this horrible disease would be to make promotional clips for social media, right? But making these clips can be as time consuming and as challenging as creating your actual show. And this is Obscurivox Syndrome in a nutshell. Luckily for you, Descript is the perfect antidote for Obscurivox Syndrome, which is a completely made up name, but a very real problem. Because with Descript, making social media clips out of your content is not only super easy, but dare I say, even a little bit fun. So let's get into it. So I have my podcast here fully edited up and I wanna make some clips for social media. So first things first, creating a new composition for my clip. So I'll click on the title of my project and choose new composition. And I'll title this composition, Social Clip One. I know very creative. Now I'll head over to the canvas and change the aspect ratio of this composition to portrait, which is the standard for social media content. Next, I'll go back to my first composition. And now all that's left to do is select the clips I wanna use. And there's a couple ways that I can do this. One, I can use the highlight feature. And this feature is super helpful when you're editing because if you see a section of your video or podcast you think would make a good social clip, you can just select it in your script and highlight it with the color of your choice. And now that I have a good amount of highlights here, all I have to do is click on this sparkle icon, go to copy highlights, and choose the color I wanna copy. And method number two, you can always just select a portion of your script and copy it that way, the same way you would in a text doc. Okay, now that I have my clip copied, I'll go back to my other composition and just paste my clip in. Then I'll use the canvas to resize it to my new aspect ratio and boom, I have my social clip all ready to be edited. Now there's no exact precise formula for making perfect social clips, the same way there's no exact precise formula for making videos or podcasts. But there are some general rules you can follow that'll help you out. The first rule, which is pretty essential, is to use captions, because these make your video not only more engaging, but more accessible to people that are hard of hearing. So to add captions, I'll go to the templates panel and select one of these pre-made captions from my clip. And if you wanna learn more about creating and customizing captions, make sure to check out our captions how-to, which will be linked in the description below. And all right, our clip is already looking pretty good so far. So let's go to our next rule. Social media clips tend to be more fast paced and visually engaging. So there's some small things I can do to my clip to make it follow that guideline. One, I can go into my features menu and shorten word gaps. Now, if I play back. I don't keep any secrets, but it felt like an even better safe space. Yeah, I don't keep any secrets, but it felt like an even better safe space. Where you can see that it feels a bit more fast paced and lively. Another thing I can do is add some effects into my clip. And this is super easy to do with the script's media library full of millions of free video and audio assets. For example, in this section of my clip, let's add a little GIF in here. And yes, it's pronounced GIF, not GIF. Hate me all you want. So I'll create a scene for the section I want my GIF to be in. And now I'll go into my media library, go to GIFs, and look for a good one I wanna use. Perfect, let's go with this one. Now, as you can see, the GIF is in my scene and I can use the canvas to change the position and size as well as the layer ordering of the GIF. And all right, now I have a perfectly social mediaized clip from my podcast that I can post wherever I want using the publish tab. And that's pretty much it. As you can see with the script, the age old problem of obscure box syndrome becomes not a problem anymore. If you have any questions on making social media clips in the script, make sure to leave a comment down below, or you can also check out our help center, which will also be linked in the description. Also be sure to check out my podcast where I talk about my vivid, relentless nightmares about Baby Yoda. They've been happening every night ever since that stupid damn show came out. All right, see you guys in the next one. Bye.